海賊王に俺はなるこんにちは、大輝です。This phrase is used by Luffy from One Piece. I'm sure you heard that phrase. 海賊王に俺はなる。Now, we're going to decipher it today. 海賊王 is a noun, right? Pirate King. Ni is a particle which we're gonna talk about later in the lesson. Ore. If you watch anime, I know you know ore. Is I. Pronoun I. Who uses it? Typically male. It is a very masculine way of using I. I would say 90% of male use this pronoun, including myself. Wa is another particle. Naru is to become. Now, feel free to pause the video. I'm gonna erase this one. So, if you look at the phrase that I just did, said, or Luffy says, I guess, you know that uh, the con sentence structure consists of O S V, right? Kaizoku oni. Ore wa naru. You know, it consists of O S V, so O, it's an object. Ore is I, so that's a subject. Naru is to become, so that's a verb. And if you know about Japanese grammar, you know this is not a natural order. Typically, I want you to remember this. Typically, Japanese grammatical structure is like this. S O V. Please remember this one. This is really important. This is a basically natural Japanese grammatical structure, okay? In English, it is SVO, so subject comes first, and verb, and the object, so I drink coffee, right? I, subject, drink, verb, coffee, object. But in Japanese, it's going to be Watashi wa kohi o object, namimasu, verb. So this is a natural one. Now, the reason why he says, like, OSV, that's a natural, is because he intends to sound poetic, or the author of the One Piece, who is Oda Sensei, wants to leave a strong impression of the line. We memorize the line because it's a unnatural. So today, instead of focusing on S OSV, we want to decipher it. Just like we do in a natural Japanese. So, S O V. S O V. Say, S O V. S O V. That's a Japanese sentence structure. S O V. S O V. Right? It should be like this. Ore wa kaizoku o ni naru. Instead of kaizoku o ni ore wa naru. Okay? So, ore wa is, you know, I as a topic. And 
I want you to pay attention to this particle and this verb. Naru is to be gone, right? So feel free to pause. Naru always goes with ni. Here's what I want you to remember. Naru always go with, goes with ni. I'm gonna do a whole video about ni particle in the future, but for now, it's gonna confuse you. So let's stick to it. Naru. goes together. Okay? Usually like this. This is this here this is what we're gonna learn today. Now ni naru or narimas. Narimas is a mass form. It just means it's, it's a casual, this is a casual way. Naru is a casual way of saying it. Narimasu is a polite way of saying it. Just keep it that way this, this time. So, I want you to remember this. Ni, naru, o narimasu. Noun, ni, naru, o narimasu. So if you want to say, I will become a doctor. Isha, ni, Naru or Narimasu? Well, let's stick to Narimasu. I will become a doctor. And you notice that I is excluded. It's, it's really common. We tend to exclude I. We just assume that if the sentence is coming out of your mouth, unless you specify he or she, we just presume that you're talking about yourself. So. O V Isha ni Narimasu ni Right? Ni is a noun, doctor Become Alright What if you want to say I will become a lawyer Lawyer is Bengoshi So Bengoshi ni Narimasu Yeah, so let's keep going with this one. What if you want to say, I will become a scientist? Scientist is kagakusha. So, why do I erase this one? I want you to think about it. How to say it. Kagakusha. So, that's right. Kagakusha ni narimasu. So, let's go back to I'll become, the, I'll, I'll become the Pirate King. He says I will become a Pirate King because he believes in himself. He's really confident. He knows he can do it, you know. And I encourage you to do the same thing, just like Luffy does, you know. I will become instead of I want to become. But in reality, I think most of us say I want to become a doctor. I want to become a lawyer when talking in a daily conversation. So, in case you're wondering how to say I want to become, Here's how you want to say it. I want to become a doctor. Isha ni naritai desu. So this makes it a polite. So without without it, if you if you exclude it, it sounds casual. That's all it is. So I want you to pay attention, so ni stays the same. Nari tai. Nari tai. Okay, so tai describes the desire to do something, so express the desire to do something, so want to be, want to do something, okay, so want to become a doctor. The rule to make this one is put the mass form. So, narimasu is a ma mass form 
of naru, right? So, narimasu. I want you to get rid of mas and replace it with tai. So, nari tai. Want to become. So, this one. Want to become. So that's how you say it. And if you're wondering, Narimas, I said I will become a doctor. This is pretty much present tense, but in Japanese, this is also a future tense. So I will do the whole video about this one in the future. So let's practice conjugating the sentence, the verb to tie form. Well, there's no such thing as tie form. I, one time I said tie form in a lesson and the teacher corrected me, he's like, yeah, that's not how you say it. So there's no type form. So type. Let's conjugate it to type. Okay, so how would you say mimas? So mimas is to see or watch. So how would you say I want to see? Mitai, exactly. Want to see. Or watch. How would you say nemas is to sleep? Netai want to sleep. Right, so one, two. Taberu tabemas eat. What's that? Tabe tai. Yeah. It's simple, right? So let's do some examples. So, what if you want to say, I want to watch a TV? What was watch again? Mimas, right? So, TV is TV. Ga mi tai desu. And if you see that sentence like this, I won't watch TV, you use ga usually. Alright. For now, let's remember as ga. So, for become, it is different. It's exceptional. Ni narimasu. It's always ni. So that's why. What if you want to say, I want to eat an apple? Apple, lingo. Particle, ga. Eat, tabemasu, becomes tabetai desu. Let's do one more. I want to drink water. Water, mizu, ga, drink. Nomimasu. Nomitai desu. Okay, so feel free to pause the video anytime, anytime you want. So today's key or takeaway is how Luffy says he wants to become a pirate king. It's not really grammatically natural. I don't say it's wrong, but it's not natural. So if you want to speak in real life, you don't talk like Luffy. Only if you want to just play it out like Kaizoku oni oru wa naru, you know, like that. Only if you want to. We also learned ni narimasu or naru. Naru is how Luffy says. We learned s o v. 
Yeah. That's a Japanese sentence structure. That is a natural sentence structure. And we also learn at the end. Mas. That's do, right? Or will do. Again. Just present tense, but can be future tense too. Becomes tai. This, if you want. Want to do. So these are the key takeaways that we did. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked it, just subscribe to my channel. If you want to see more of these question uh, contents, subscribe to my channel. I really appreciate it. And I'll see you in the next one. Until next time.